all my beautiful gems how are you all doing today i just want to wish you all a safe and an enjoyable day wherever you are so today i'll be making boil and fry breadfruit and i'm on my way to border market to get me one hello are you selling the breadfruit 300 i give it to 300 thank you so i'm done now join me. Let's get to my kitchen and start cooking. So first thing what I like to do is to put a little bit of oil on my hand and my knife. Because when you cut into the breadfruit, it releases a milk-like substance and it's kind of sticky. So by rubbing the oil on my hand, it helps me out a lot. So this is a large breadfruit and I'll use half to make chips or fries and the other half I'll boil it and then fry it. So I'll cut these up in a few pieces. Take out the seed and the skin. And then I'll wash it and cut it up. For the chips, I'm going to slice them thin. In that way, it will cook faster. Now, I'm going to season it with a little bit salt to taste. Now, I'm going to give it a good mix. Now, for the boil and fry way, I like to cut them in bite-sized pieces. So before we go any further, you're probably wondering, whose parrot is making that noise? Well, it's mine. This is Jade, our pet. What you say? What you say? Hi. Her name derived from the ornamental stone, Jade. My kids gave her that name. She is an orange wing Amazon parrot. Peekaboo! 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 Man, guess what I want? I want some fries. I want some barbecue sauce on the side. Don't forget the chicken wings that I ordered. Are you gonna get next to say your head with a quarter? Okay, bye! Okay, bye bye. Bye. She's very curious. That's my daughter and her every day. She loves the camera and she's so sassy. So now back to cooking. Now I'm going to fry these in the hot oil. until it's golden brown. I'll use a paper towel when I take it out to help absorb some of the oil that is left on the chips. Now my breadfruit chips is finished. You can have it with any sauce you like. Today I'm having it with pepper sauce. Now time for my boil and fry breadfruit.
Now these are the ingredients I'll be using today. Crushed garlic, shallot, celery, fine thyme, very rare pepper, and red onion. Season the water with salt and add my breadfruit. And cover it halfway and let it boil until it's tender. After about 30 minutes, I'm gonna check. Yes, it's boiled. Now I'm going to strain it. Now I'm going to put some oil to hot and then add my garlic, my fine thyme. My red onion, pepper, and two cubes. I'm going to let this fry a bit and then I'll add some water. And let it evaporate just a little because when I'm ready to add my boiled breadfruit, it will be easy to turn. Now I'm going to add my celery and shallot and it's done. Now you can have this with any side dish like salt fish but tonight I'm having it with steamed kalaloo and stew chicken. So my beautiful gems remember everyone cooks differently Hope you'll give my recipe a try and enjoy it. Thank you all for watching my video. God bless you. See you in my next video.